Hi, I'm Justin. We're going to answer some questions about roofing. First question, what questions should I ask my roofer? First off, I would see if they have an actual office, a physical address that they work out of. That'll prove that they have been in the community, they're not going anywhere in the reputable company. Because of that, second question I would ask is if they have any type of warranty. What are their warranties? Those will be something that they should have on their contract, an actual legal contract, nothing they typed up in Word that morning. It'll be an actual real professional contract. And third, you should ask if they have insurance. They can provide that for you if, uh, if you ask them to show that they are covering themselves in the case of something were to happen. Second question, how do roofers stay on the roof? Whenever we have a steeper roof or a slick metal roof that is steep, our guys will use fall protection, harnesses, all the required safety stuff to make sure that they stay put and are able to do what they need to do. They'll also use tow boards and walk boards and things like that um, to help keep them on the roof. Next, what do roofers do when it rains? We keep our guys off the roof. Safety is always first. Not safe to be on the roof when it's, when it's raining, wet, slippery. But it is a great time to find leaks and most people don't see their leaks, notice them until it's actually raining. That's a perfect time to actually find where the water's coming in. Next, where do roofers use the bathroom? On shorter projects, we will go off-site to use facilities somewhere just out of respect for people's uh, property or homes. We won't use um, their restrooms. But on larger commercial jobs, we will bring in uh, portable restrooms and things of that nature um, for the guys, um, make sure they're taken care of. Last, how can I find a cheap roofer? Um, myself, like anyone else, trying to get the most bang for your buck. Um, definitely in roofing, you, that's uh, misleading. You don't want to get the cheapest person out there. Reason being, most, most contractors um, will give you a good thorough bid, but if there's one cheaper, they're either intentionally leaving something out or just not thorough, and they will nickel and dime you through the process of other things they come across. So a lot of times a more expensive uh, roofer will actually be very thorough and have everything up front that you will need.